Hello friends, this is Umesh Arora from CATCAM Solution Mirat and today we are going to create this tail stock body in CATIA B5 and here we have two views, one is side view and second is sectional front view. So with the help of these two view, we are going to create this 3D. So let's start with the CATIA B5 and if you are new to our channel, please do subscribe our channel. So uh, first of all, select this sketch and I am starting from this ZX plane and switch off this user selection filter and don't select anyone just close this and here in sketch tool switch off the second option snap to point and rest keep the same and I am starting with this profile or rectangle so this is a rectangle now dimension it this dimension is 150 and this distance is 25 and double click over is this constraint so you can use this tool multiple okay and click and click here and a half of 150 is 75 so uh, this is my first sketch and here we have to create this portion as well because if we will see this is coming here okay so <coughs> just exit this and extrude this in one direction 150 is the height so we have created that portion and I have extruded in 150 in this direction okay so now uh, select this plane sketch and draw one more rectangle now select these two and here Consident to make it consident now dimension it and this depth is 10 so double click and change and again select this this is 30 and from vertical axis this is 15 and close again extrude this up to 150 okay see Okay, my first step is complete and now I'm going to create this portion. So same plane I'm selecting for that and create circle one and one more circle and again circle here we have one more circle. So draw and now dimension it. So double click over this constraint and click the 30 is a radius 60 will diameter again for this the circle is 30 diameter so change it to 30 and it's here 15 is a radius so 30 will be diameter and the distance between these two circle is 35 to change it to 35 Okay, and the height is 125 from the upper edge, means from the horizontal axis. This distance is 125. My sketch is green now, and I'm just projecting one line. So click here, and I want to project this line. Okay, and rest I will do with this single line. Click here, and click again, single line, and click. Okay. <clears throat> So here first we will extrude this just delete this circle because it is not required now and here this trim trim this okay and finish it and the thickness of this is 18 so extrude 18 millimeter and 
here this portion we have to click create so select this and the second sketch I am showing this and use this project 3d element I need this circle and this half circle okay or just delete we will create ourselves and one more circle here now dimension it this is 30 diameter circle and it is 60 and the distance between these two circles is 35 again trim this trim this and this line will extend so select this line from the mid drag and here from the tangent or from the okay, just create this line as well click okay now trim I don't require this extra line trim and I need this portion so I am deleting extra portion what I have and this is over constraint so delete it so my sketch is now complete now exit and extrude this up to 100 here you will find this 100 okay and for this rib this rib which we have to cut so for that rib I am going on the same plane and here this line and offset here and the distance is 18 and click sorry project it project this and here draw any line now use the string don't require this extra lines okay and define some value for this and exit extrude this up to 150 okay it will merge inside this now I want to cut this extra portion means this arc I'm going to create this arc for this arc select the middle plane and here use this three point arc and my arc will start from here so click and rotate up to center of this and click here now we will position it and just select this point and uh, end point with the control hold the control and make them coincident and for this select uh, the dimension of this point and this line is 0 and from center to 35 again from center from center to this point is 35 and dimension of this radius is 125 see here okay 125 now normal it and make some extra lines because I want to cut it now it is my close sketch just dimension it and exit and cut it Review and okay. Okay, hide this sketch and now uh, one sketch I have to create here. So click and draw a circle at the middle and one more circle. Okay, now dimension it. The outer circle is 40 diameter and inside circle is 18 diameter. 
एंड फ्रॉम हियर दिस पोजिशन इज हाफ ऑफ वन फिफ्टी इज सेवेंटी फाइव नाउ क्लोज एंड एक्सट्यूड दिस एट डिस्टेंस ऑफ सिक्स एंड प्लाई सम फ्रेड विच इज ऑल्सो सिक्स ओके एंड वी हैव टू कट दिस सो सिलेक्ट दिस क्लिक येस एंड क्लिक अगेन एंड ड्रैग अप टू नेक्स्ट एंड ओके सो इट विल कट दिस ओके सो टू होल्स आर रिमेन सो आई एम यूजिंग दिस होल एंड आई वॉन्ट होल हियर फर्स्ट पोजिशन इट दिस आउटर सर्कल एंड दिस पॉइंट make them constant or concentric concentric exit here the this m15 type of this circle we have already here threaded hole okay so we have matrix which okay and here M fifteen is not available. M sixteen is available, so I am using this. M sixteen, and the thread depth is hundred minus thirty six is a uh, hundred minus thirty six, and hole depth hole depth is seventy, and. right hand or left hand or okay just apply this okay now only some fillets are remaining so i am using this fillet and default fillet is 5 and here on this edge and this edge preview okay okay and again this fillet here okay it is So just select this minimal. So here it will come, and here also, and click. So fillet will come. And here also, see here it is also. You can see from this view, you can see. Okay. So my sketch is complete. I finish it. and here we have one visualization toolbar where we i will get the cross section now for this m12 hole uh, i have to create a plane at 32 mm away so i will get this from insert and uh, here i will get this so uh, plain so just expand this so that i can the toolbar is reference element this is the plain okay select this and click and reverse the direction and distance is 32 So now, over this plane, I am going to create a circle. So uh, this twelve, and I think it is a counter hole. So I am selecting a circle, draw here, and positioning it and dimension twelve. I am selecting this as fifteen or fourteen. and distance is 36 from the back from here thirty-six and its position is
15 okay half of 30 is 15 now pinch it and extrude cut this pocket preview okay and a little bit more so drag this limit outside and with the help of this hole over this space and this time it is M12 and it is throughout so it is cutting throughout just go and define this position and make them concentric okay so this is our model so I think you understand how to create this model right click and hide hide this plane as well 